Hey YouTube, this is another review by me. Forgot my username, so let's get started. This is a Lego Creator number three and one set three one zero zero two. Super Racer two hundred and twelve pieces recommended for ages six through twelve. And it is a three and one. Looks like the main build is a Formula One car or a mini Indy. I watch a lot of racing, so I know these things. And uh, we're gonna only build this one, and I already have it built. But it can rebuild into a quad bike. Which I guess that's four wheeler right there. Then a go kart. The go kart looks kind of cool. I actually built that one because I just felt like wasting time. But I ended up rebuilding it into this. You can see all the parts you'll need. Not that many parts, only 121 to build a nice car. Then you got your wheel size, you go to the back, see things a little more clearly. Go kart has pretty nice features, like the seat, how it curves. Then that's the main build. That's what we'll be reviewing today. I might create a go kart. I might create all of the reviews. I probably won't, but if I ever get bored, I probably will. But, don't get your hopes up. And then the quad bike. It looks kind of cool. I mean, all of these sets do have the wheels. They all have the weird way. So, let's get started. Get these boxes out of the way. And here we have the Super Racer. Look at it from the front. It has the splinter of the Indy car. This is probably supposed to be a window. That's your air scoop behind. That's where the driver's heads go. You can fit a minifigure in this, except the head will be right above here. So, it's your option. Your tires. You've got some spacers in between them. And you can, if you try putting them on with this side out, it won't work. I've tried that. Your tire will be way too far in. They got a lot of yellow pieces. This is probably the most yellow car I've ever seen. In Lego, you got your grill pieces here. I actually used these on the Lego NASCAR before I turned it all red. So you can look up that. It's actually instructions on how to build it. Custom. So you can see you go through here. Everything is very flat or curved. It's for the aerodynamics. You see the rear spoiler, it isn't completely covered. You have this little part going over just a plain flat and then you have the little pieces same piece we use right here going back there it has rear view mirrors the white ones little white angled pieces they use for the window and the steering wheel if we look into the interior very small it's only it's a one person race car so we look into the back see this part curves down here I think they could have done something right here like a f put a flat or something but they didn't follow the instructions this kind of looks cool because if you put it like this it looks like a wing it's like a rocket ship but it curves down over the tire so the only way you could clip the tires is run right into it from the side but we're not here to destroy them, we're here to build them. Now this part, very nice. And you can see it right there, it's just a wing part. You remove that and put it right back there. And tires, you see you can see them on the box, I already showed you that. It's got tail lights on all of them, they're all basically in the same place. And you can see, we used a 1x4 with the holes right here so we can fit the tires in. We used one extending rod for all the tires. We did that for the Highway Speedster. That, that, view, that review is posted right now, hopefully. So you can look that up. And the front end, very curvy. It's kind of flat right here, but it curves up. And as you can see the air going over it, very aerodynamic car. And that is the Lego review of the Super Racer. Thanks for watching. Peace out.